Hello, and welcome to Leon's Lock Pad. The Black Spur that lock that I did uh, in a previous video, the Halloween special, it was a very quick pick. Um, I thought I'd have a good gut in it, and see what we've got. There's the casing, it's plastic. There's the lock itself. And um, what I've done is, got the grinder out and ground the um, all the rivets off. I have pre-disassembled this lock and then put it back together again. Just in case, I did it just in case it basically all fell apart and it would have been a very long video. Let's uh, let's. There we go. We've got a spring. There we go. We've got a spring. Here's your bottom plate. And there's your core. Interestingly, let me see this. Let me uh, undo it. Still works. Let's pop the core out. The core has a plastic casing. Um, just really cheap. I've never seen a plastic casing in a padlock before, or any type of lock. But it makes sense now why um, I wasn't getting no feedback from it properly. And when I was uh, putting some tension on it, there was no feel the spring wasn't pulling it back at all to give me any type of feedback and it's because it's just binding as you turn it it's really stiff this uh metal rubbing on the inside of this plastic i certainly think that's why there was a uh, no feedback um the core itself the tumbler from what i can see let me get the key out it's not brass it's a uh, cheap cast metal and I can see that it's split all the way along. I don't know if you can see that, no sorry. I've got an example one here. Basically it's exactly the same as this core. It's just got split all the way along. So it's just really cheap and nasty. Uh, this lock would be, the only thing it's good for is uh, for stripping it and seeing how it works. You can get yourself a, a little core to play with and repin maybe, just have a faff around, strip it, see how it all works. But as a security device, what a load of junk. I mean, from what I can see, with it being plastic, if you, um, if you took a screwdriver, Got one, but it's not it's too big. If you took a screwdriver, thin enough, banged it in there, even with the, the bottom of your hand like that, I suppose you did it hard enough. You're gonna twist this whole thing around. It's just gonna strip all this and you're gonna undo the lock. The basically the lock's just gonna pop open. So you don't even need no hammers to to have a go at smacking the shackle off or anything like that. You know someone you're just going to be able to stick a screwdriver in it and force it until this just splits and it's just going to open up but definitely junk a complete waste of time so um if you do come across these like i say unless you want one just to strip don't use it for any security purposes absolute rubbish complete waste of money i'm just really quite surprised i've just never seen plastic casing around it Ever. I mean, it's even got a circlip and it's got a steel circlip. I've seen other ones where they just don't have nothing there at all. It's just got little lips to stop it going through. But yeah, please stay away from the Black Spur locks, the absolute junk. Um, thank you very much for watching. Please subscribe and give a like, and I will see you soon. Bye.